Following a 1-1 draw with Aberdeen at Pataudry, the New Look White Blues announced their championship credentials in style with a stunning 4-2 victory over Celtic at Parkhead. Kenny Miller bagged a brilliant double against his old side, and Pedro Mendes blasted the goal of the season past Arthur Boric. Kuzan up against Wilson. He's away. It's Kuzan, and he scored! Daniel Kuzan, a surprise starter, seizes the moment. This is sheer brilliance from Kuzan. Get the ball to him and he'll run. He'll take on defenders. And look how cool he is when he gets himself into the position. But many a striker would get his head up and think, right, I've done my job, I'm going to lay it back. But no intention of that. Maloney, oh, Sabaras! Celtic respond straight away! How much? Adam. Stephen Davis. Pedro Mendes. Davis. Celtic in the way when it counts. Kuzan. It's Kenny Miller now! How predictable was that? It just had to happen! It takes a long time this ball to get to him. Kuzan again, initially very good play. It's a lovely ball over. Miller's online, he's not offside. And he can only go one place. It's all about how he does it. Thompson floats over, and he gets it down into the ground, back across Boric. And that's just a fabulous finish. Card here for a series of offences from Daniel Kuzan. And there's a quote of the referee, we don't want to get involved in like that. Davis fools everyone by picking out Pedro Mendes. That is just brilliant! Fabulous! It's just sensational. He comes across it from fully 25 yards. Such a difficult technique to master this one, but boy does he catch that one sweetly. Well, McManus has reacted to Kuzan here. It's a yellow card for Kuzan, his second. He's off, sent off, not for the first time in his Rangers career. And they're going to have to see this out with ten men. Reaching boiling point at Celtic Park, and there's been a reaction here. Oh, and Veligoy Hesselik has been sent off. Put off the ball. Two red cards in such a short space of time, and he hasn't been on long. Veligoy of Hesselik walks, and Celtic, like Rangers, are down to ten men. Broadfoot now, and it's spilled, Kenny Miller must score, Boric with an incredible howler, and Miller has struck again, happy days are here again for Rangers. Broadfoot, as ever, happy to go down that right hand side, and he whips a good ball in, Boric, what is he thinking about, he must just take his eye off the ball, he's casual there at the front post area, it comes in, Look at this, how easy does it get for Kenny Miller? Two goals in a game that we never knew what to expect from the Scotland striker. Nakamura preparing. Free kick. But it's not one that's going to matter much to Celtic, whatever the outcome really. Nakamura has found the bottom corner, adding to his free kick collection. Celtic may have had the last word in this game, but Rangers are having the last laugh. Well, I enjoyed it very much. I don't think it could, could go better than it was. Uh, good game, good performance, good team performance. Uh, we came here and we showed what we're capable to do. 
um, you know, we are a good team, we could like to play football, so we came here to play our football and we had the three points. It must have been very satisfying to hear the Celtic fans go quiet after you scored the second, third and fourth goals. Well, that's the best part of a derby when you play away, uh, when the game goes for you and uh, and you're winning and uh, all that noise that uh, the home fans use to put some pressure on you. When that noise goes away, I think that's the best part. What a result and 